Hey there, it's Dr. Jim, and I have a very important uh, topic because what we used to call alcoholism has been reworded to alcohol use disorder, and I understand why. There's more of a clinical aspect of using the words alcohol use disorder and less of a stigma which is attached to alcoholism or being an alcoholic. I'm an individual who simply has alcohol use disorder. This affects millions and millions of Americans and people around the entire planet. But my question for you today is this. Can CBD be effective in treating alcohol use disorder? I write about it in my book. I'm passionate about it. I never stop learning about this topic and, and hundreds of other topics because I do believe only after reading hundreds of articles from professional, academic, medical, prestigious journals from around the world that CBD can be effective. So let me just briefly define what I mean by alcohol use disorder, okay? Alcohol use disorder is a condition in which the individual feels the need to consume alcohol even when the behavior is negatively affecting his or her life. I'm a wreck. I might lose my job. My relationship is terrible. I get into fights. I'm angry when I drink, but I still drink. That might be alcohol use disorder. This condition affects adults and even young people as young as 12, and maybe even younger, and is associated with alcohol-related liver disease. There, there's a physical price to pay for this. Psychological too. Depression, cancer, stroke, heart disease, and I could go on. It can also cause psychological, social, interpersonal, and a whole heck of a lot of financial problems. And it might lead to alcohol-related liver disease, and this is a terrible, terrible thing to have. Alcohol-related liver disease can develop due to chronic consumption of alcohol over long periods of time. Essentially, alcohol puts a devastating strain on your liver, causing severe inflammation and liver failure, which might lead to an earlier death bad stuff. Okay, now let's talk about the research findings looking at CBD as a potential treatment for alcohol use disorder, which we used to call alcoholism. Point number one, CBD may prevent liver inflammation and damage caused by excessive alcohol consumption. We know, I know, CBD is a wonderful anti-inflammatory agent. Two, in studies using rats, because rats have an anatomy very close to ours, you dirty rat, that's why we're called dirty rats, because, you know, our, our anatomies are very close. Even little mice, we, we're pretty close to them too. And, you know, this is preclinical. Preclinical means we're using rodents. In these studies with rodents, CBD was shown to decrease impulsive behaviors, impulsive drinking, specifically with alcohol and cocaine. Poor rats. And the benefits lasted up to five months. Rats taking CBD did extremely well. Oh, up to five months because the CBD reduced the impulse the craving for alcohol and cocaine. Third, in some studies, CBD was shown to reduce drinking behaviors and drinking alcohol, period. Intake, it reduced intake. Now, there's a science behind it, and I was just talking about this with a chiropractor yesterday. Very brilliant person. The HPA axis, that bundle of nerves that goes down the center of our brain, <clears throat> when we take a substance, it lights up like a Christmas tree. The neurons, the neurotransmitters, they fire. 
our brain is somewhat wired to like substances. Our brain is somewhat wired to become addicted to or become impulsive about certain things. CBD has been shown in studies to interact with the neurons, neurotransmitters, and the HPA axis and reduce craving. That's important. Another fact in studies. It's well known that CBD has neuroprotective benefits and it may protect the brain against alcohol-related brain damage. That's a great benefit. Another. One study found that a combination of CBD and a drug called naltrexone which is used to treat alcohol use disorder, was better than just one of those alone. CBD, decent effects. Naltrexone, good effects. Mix them together in combination, better effects. So there you have it. If you know someone who is battling and dealing with alcohol use disorder, naltrexone and CBD combination... In a study with humans, people who use CBD for five days consumed less alcohol and had fewer days of drinking, leading researchers to believe this. It may help to curb consumption and reduce cravings. So there you have it. I could go on and on. Here's the article. It's, it's online. You can find it, read it, share it, email it to your colleagues and friends. But my final thoughts are, are this. We have, we have a lot of alcohol use in the United States and around the world, and some individuals act, can actually be diagnosed with alcohol use disorder, what we used to call alcoholism. And there are treatments. But can an all-natural, organically grown, or purely organic substance from hemp plants, medical hemp plants, can these help individuals with any type of addiction or problem related to this, but alcohol use disorder in particular. Can CBD reduce cravings, consumption, and help people get back on track and stop their behaviors related to alcohol use disorder? Let me know what you think. Visit me at collinslearning.com, ceu.academy. I'm all over the place. Email me, jim at sapphire-essentials.com. I have a very busy blog, drjimcollins.com. Let me know what you think about this topic. Should we use CBD for alcohol use disorder? I'd love to hear from you. Thank you for watching the video. And I'd like to show you my new book, Living Longer and Stronger with CBD. It took me about a year and a half to write as I scanned hundreds of articles in prestigious journals, peer-reviewed medical studies, examining the effects of CBD for various physical conditions, emotional and mental issues, and neurodegenerative conditions. And I condensed all of those findings into one book. I believe that there's something in here for everyone. So if you're interested, follow the link to the book on Amazon. Thank you so much.